Hey guys, Nessa here, and today I want to share with you my Lego Dimensions story pack. It is the Lego Batman movie, and it comes with 156 pieces, and it is set number 71264. Um, this one is for my PS4, but you can use it for whichever one that you get. Yeah, it's, it's, they work on all of them, I guess. Um... But yeah, this is the last story pack I have here. My box is a bit beat up. I got it this way. Um, yeah. Oops. So. That's pretty cool. And the little bat wing also turns into the black thunder and the bat tank. So that's kind of cool. And the bottom is a little messed up. This one's from 2017. Um, whenever um, they stopped doing the dimensions, I got... A whole bunch. I just started getting them all on clearance and whatever. So I got this one for like, I think about half off or whatever. So yeah, it wasn't about, oh my gosh, I keep hitting that. So yeah, actually I think I'm going to leave it this way because I want you guys to see those when I do them. Um, but to, to play the game, I mean you can buy this just to get it, but if you want to use it to play the game, you've got to have the Lego portal pad thingy um, to make your figures work. So yeah, I have the the portal pad here, and I've already built the um, the structure. Let me actually just move that. I need more space. Um, yeah. So I already put it together. This is the little base or whatever that they use. Um, you can. Uh, there are three other story packs plus the original that comes with this. Um, but yeah, I don't know. The lighting's a little wonky. Let's see if I can fix it. Yeah, it's a little better. Um, all these are printed pieces, but um, all one, how many other? There's six of them. All six of them are the same printed piece. They just have me put them in different directions on here so it is what it is but yeah oh my gosh my camera's like so wobbly it's so weird my new little mini camera stand is very wobbly and man is it bright <laughs> so yeah this is what the base looks like and um it also comes with the two mini figs and the machine little whatever it was called was it the bat wing but um here's the minifigs here is batgirl she's pretty cool she has her own printed base so this one's her so even with her not on it this base will still register as it being her she's got nice printing she has a yellow um batarang or whatever it is She's got nice printing. She even has like buckles on her boots, which are cool. Uh, she has two faces. She has that one with a smirk. And then that one where she's like, oh my gosh. Um, and since her helmet's off, I'll take this off. She does have some printing on the back. Yeah. Uh, that looks funny. Um, and then this is her mask. Uh, but this is her hair piece that goes through the mask. It actually just pops on. I wish it was actually reversed, like, with the pin. So you could add it as, like, an extra hair piece or something to something else. But this is, makes it more difficult to do that. Come on. There we go. So, yeah, her ponytail's going through her mask. But, yeah, so she's cool. So whenever you do this... You initially put them here in the middle to start the figure. And then as you play and you need more figures, you can move it here. You can have three on this side and three on this side and one here. So technically you can have seven things going on at the same time. But you kind of don't want to do that because it just it makes it harder to play. Um, you always want to leave a couple spots open. Um, and also sometimes it makes you play... A game with this, this lights up different colors and you have to like 
play kind of like a Simon Says kind of thing, in a way. Like when it tells you, oh, red, and if this is lit up red, then you have to move it to red. And if it says, oh, you need to go to green, and then you got to come over here or whatever. So, yeah, you have to move wherever the color is for that. All right, and then here's Robin. He's kind of cool. He has his own printed base as well. He's funny. And then there's the printing on the back for him. Ah. His glasses are actually attached to his hair. So he has that face and that face. Which the eyes doesn't really matter because his glasses, like I said, are attached to his hair. So you kind of can't really see it anyway. Yeah. But that's Robin. And uh, here is the Batwing. <laughs> This one's cool. I like this one. And again, this one um, just has a plain base. And um, you can actually interchange these. They kind of forget what they are. Um, and you just program them as you go. And again, you would use the center to program what you want it to be. And this doesn't have to be on it. But it does help if it's on there, so you kind of remember what vehicle it is or whatever, you know? So it just makes it simpler when you play. But, yeah. Um, I'll show you a couple of the other things real quick, and then I will do the other two builds for that. Well, it came with the box for the capes, of course. Um, the build itself, the, the whole, like, bat cave looking thing for them, uh, came with four extra pieces, just four studs. And then, um, and then between, I guess, yeah, and another red dot, and this one too came with that. Um, but then there was an extra, then there was these extras as well. So, yeah, we got those extra pieces for the whole build and for the minifigs and stuff. Um, it also came with an instruction book. It says you can play the complete movie. Now, normally in the Dimensions instruction books, you only get... Um, especially for the little ones, you only get to know how to make the figures. Like, it just shows you how to do the figures and then you need the portal pad. Um, but this one actually shows you how to to build the little backdrop here. Oh, I locked her over. So, yeah, it's kind of cool that it shows you that. And then in the back, of course... Uh, like yeah, it says, you need to download the latest game content to use this character. Um, yeah. And then building is part of the play, uh, part of playing the game. So in the back, it shows you like what other sets you can get, and of course, I need these three, but I have this one. I really want to get them all. These ones are level packs. Um, on this page, I have Sloth. Um, I don't have the other three. I need those. I really want to get them all. I think they're kind of cool. I'm trying to find people to sell them. Um, I have the Scooby-Doo pack, but I don't have these ones. I do want them. And then for this page, I have these two, but I need that one. So yeah, these are the team packs. Um, and then we have the story packs, which I have these ones as well. I have, I have all three now, so yeah. And then for the fun packs, um, I have Superman and I have Cyberman, but I need all the others. Slimer's cool. And then for this page, I actually have... Yeah, I have all six of those, so that's cool. And then, of course, this one has a parts list, which is nice. So, yeah. So that's kind of cool, too. But, let's get that out of the way. Alrighty, so again, this is what the Batwing looks like. 
and I will show you what the the Black Thunder looks like. Alrighty, and here is the Black Thunder. It looks pretty cool, and it still and it rolls too. So that's kind of cool. So some of these have playability, which is nice, and it still fits on the the portal pad. I don't know the lighting. I don't know why the lighting does what it does. I'm sorry, but um, yeah, this one's actually a pretty good one too. I don't know. I'm gonna have a hard time picking between the three. I actually kind of like all three of them, but yeah, this one's pretty nice. So um, let me show you the bat tank. Alrighty, and this one is the bat tank. Um, it's kind of cool. It's big and chunky. Yeah. I don't know. And this one, this one rolls too. So, yeah. Which is kind of cool. And it still fits on the portal pad thingy. It moves around. You know, you can do what you need to do with it. Um, it's cool. Um, out of the three though, um, I do prefer the Batwing. And then I like the Black Thunder. But then this one's kind of, yeah, I don't know. I mean, I like all of them, but this one's definitely not my favorite. But, yeah. So, yeah. Um, I'm glad I got it when I did. I mean, I'm missing a whole bunch of sets. Um, but I want them because I do have the game. Um, I haven't gotten very far. I know I need to just sit down and just play it and do it. Um... I'm thinking about doing videos for it, but I don't know that I should or not. I don't know if anybody would be interested in that. I mean, I'm not really good at, like, talking through the videos and stuff about what I'm doing. I just play. So, yeah. But, um, other than that, um, I hope you guys, uh, enjoyed this video. Um, I thought this set was pretty cool. So, yeah. And, um, I hope to see you guys in future videos. So, have a good day, keep on breaking, and bye.